Most brands fail with AI because their GPT spits out the same generic shit. In this video, I'll show you how to train your custom GPT so it can crank out ad concepts that actually win. If you're a performance marketer, you already know, refreshing creative is where the alpha lives. Welcome back to part two of building a custom GPT for your brand that doesn't suck. If you missed part one, go ahead and watch that first because that's gonna cover how to set up your brand GPT folder and build your first training docs. But today we are going to add three new ones to this. It's the paid ad strategy, the ad experiment strategy, and the campaign set training doc. So inside your GPT, go ahead and prompt, create me an ad strategy training doc. So my custom GPT knows all the platforms we run paid ads on, plus the formatting. So we got platforms, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube pre-roll, Google search, and 15-second podcast reads, TikTok if you're into that, and have it concept, add objectives for a product launch, top of funnel, mid, and bottom of funnel, post-purchase types for each platform, and messaging pillars kind of pulled from your brand docs. We're going to do creative frameworks for each ad type and a launch campaign cadence across the entire funnel. So we're going to open that in Canvas so we can polish it, save it, and lock it down. So next we're going to prompt, build me a training doc for an ad experiment strategy. Make sure it covers objectives and KPIs at top of funnel, mid, and bottom. So experiment framework we're going to pop in here. So kind of like solution, demo, testimonial, hook, reels, BTS. We're going to make sure it covers creative variables. So like hook in the first three seconds, VO versus text. UGC versus cinematic versus founder, CTA phrasing, etc. The next thing we're going to make sure it covers is channel considerations. So it knows meta and IG are going to be like 15 to 20 seconds with bold hooks, subs, vertical. TikTok's going to be a little bit more trend driven, raw UGC, and YouTube is going to be more about storytelling, paced for view through Google, static versus motion, and some headline variations and then the testing process. So we're gonna ask for three to five variants per cycle. So we're gonna also ask it to do an ad copy framework with our hook, body, visual core, and CTA. And then we're gonna do a creative brief structure for your team. So we're gonna proof it, make sure it's all good, lock it down, and save it to your brand folder. And finally, let's hit the campaign training doc. So this is what's gonna tie everything together so you can generate a full launch package with one prompt. Okay, here's that prompt. Create me a campaign launch set training doc so my custom GPT knows what to output when I say create my launch set for this product. So the launch set should include email launch strategy doc, social launch strategy doc, PDP launch doc, paid ad strategy doc, paid ad experiment doc. So we're gonna save it, upload it, and now you're ready to test. Just drop in your product training doc from part one we're going to type in create my launch set for this product and watch it build the whole thing. Bing, bang, boom, edit, polish, hand it off to your creative team. And you just ran a full GTM strategy in five minutes. All right. All the prompts I just walked through and kind of that whole process are available at viboes.co. That's the platform my team and I are building. So you don't have to patch all this shit together manually like in these videos. So subscribe so you don't miss next week's video where we're going to expand your custom GPT with even more capabilities. I'm Jeff with Polar Pro and Vibe OS. See you next week.